the Weatherby's Mares Hurdle is next. This is a two mile listed hurdle race for Phillies and Mares of four year olds. Not one's on top one is Banana Boat for Graham Clutterbuck. Big Swizzle, Alex Cherry. First Royal, David Hooley. Jubilee Angel for Jim Murray. Limelight for Greg Beckwith. Mandrake Root, Martin Lidham. Ringer Rumor Step, Darren Thompson. And Venaria Prins for David Robertson. So, a field of eight this time. Restricted to the Phillies and Mares, and called in, and away they go. Get the way towards the first flight in this one. Mandrake Root on the inside of the purple and white stripes, a returner from last season, winner over both hurdles and fences. And first run, I also think, was around and won last season as well, but David Hooley has now taken it up. So it's first run, who's in the lead by about four, and a line of five of them pretty much together. They make this long run towards the first of the ten flights they'll take in this two miler. So ten flights over two miles and a long one to the first means they're going to come up pretty thick and fast when they do start coming up. And first Royal leads into the first. Over they all go a bit of a slow jump there by Big Swizzle. Well, plenty of time to make up for that yet. And first Royal is clearing the lead by a good six as they get to flight two. Which they're all safely over. With the ring of rumour step on the outside. Venaria Prince and Jubilee Angel dispute in second as they get over flight number three. Mandrake Root has now dropped to the back alongside the only grey in the field, Banana Boat. But they're passing the winning post now then, with a complete circuit to go. And the first rule is six lengths clear of the remainder. They are headed by Ringer Rumor Step. And Jubilee Angel on the inside of that one second. And on the rail is Big Swizzle, who's in fourth. And Limelight trying to get a bit closer to the grey banana boats also moved forward a bit as Vidalia Prince has just dropped back a little bit and has been pushed along by the jockey Mandrake Root finding the pace just a little bit hot that one might be better over two and a half these days but it's first Royal who continues to show the weight a good five as they get to flight four and they also go with that one with the order Pretty much as you were, the big swizzlers moved into second there as they take number five. Andre Root was untidy at the back. Difficult to see that one playing any part in the finish at the moment as they get to number six. A good jump there by Venaria Prince has seen that one move right through into second place. But first of all, just being given a hurry up now by the pilot as they get to the seventh. That's the fourth for moment over that one. It was first Royal who led by about two lengths to Venaria Prenz who's in second. Ring of Rumor Step is third. Big Swizzle under pressure on the inside is fourth. Then Limelight Jubilee Angel is still there. So is Banana Boat. Mandrake Root tailed off but it's first Royal then still in the lead with a two length lead as they swing towards this long home straight. There's still three flights of hurdles to take and first Royal is in the lead by three lengths to Venaria Prenz in second. Ring of Rumor Step is third third and Banana Boat is four. Then comes Big Swizzle and Limelight Jubilee Angel after that one as they race down towards his third last flight. Then now with first Royal win in the lead pretty much all the way. But Ring of Rumor Step now coming through to challenge in second. Venaria Prince, Big Swizzle, Jubilee Angel, Banana Boat looks to be dropping out of it now but it's first Royal still in the lead. Two to jump over the second last first Royal jumped it well. Got away from it well. Ring of Rumor Step's closing but not all that quickly. It's still first Royal. One to jump only a fur on to go. First Royal comes to it. Jumps it well but a better jump by Ring of Rumor Step and now Ring of Rumor Step starts to try and assert on the outside. First Royal's trying to battle back. Coming on the outside. Jubilee Angel finishing like an absolute train as they wrap up towards the run and Jubilee Angel might have just stolen it. It was almost four and a line, and I wouldn't like to call that because the angle, as we've seen so many times before on these photo finishes, is very deceptive. And you could argue a case for all of them, but Jubilee Angel and Ringer River Step have dead heated for the Mayor's Hurdle, and so Jim Murray's Jubilee Angel finishing like an absolute train. Ringer River Step for Darren Thompson just holding on, so. A dead heat there then, and first one for David Hooley, unlucky back in third, Venaria Prinz for David Robertson was fourth, and Big Swizzle for Alex Cherry was fifth.